Hello, everyone. So Anishchak here, continuing the uh, workbook lessons of A Course of Miracles. And today we're on uh, review six. We're continuing with review, review six. And we're on lesson 204. And as um, with all of these review lessons, we are hearing and reading and reinforcing that as it reads here, I am not a body. I am free for I am still as God created me. And this is a review of a lesson 184. And, it, and the lesson is the name of God is my inheritance. And this inheritance is all that God is. That's our inheritance. Love, peace, joy, innocence, and our holiness. We're whole and complete as well. It's just that as it says here, God's name reminds me that I am his son, not a slave to time, unbound by laws, which rule the world of sick illusions, free in God forever and forever one with him. In eternity, for eternity, now and forever. Again, I am not a body. I am free, for I, I am still as God created me. So here's some notes that, uh, you know, in my reflection on this uh, lesson is that, you know, it, it's the sick illusions of the world, you know, the idols of the world uh, that we need to detach from. This uh, attachment to the world that we focus on, that consumes our time, and we're slave to it. And it, you know, it blocks our awareness of our divine inheritance, which is speaking of in this lesson. And then we continue, we continue in, in the lessons here of the course to undo, to truly um, become awake to, I am not a body, I am free. You know, also, uh, we're not we're not an ego and we are not our thoughts. We are not our ego thoughts. We just believe that we are. You know, the body, again, is merely a, uh, a communication device. It's a means of communication. Or it's our vehicle, I should say, of communicating here. And. You know, from the, the introduction, right from the very beginning, the introduction of this course, it says, and I'm reading it, this course does not aim at teaching you the meaning of love. For that is beyond what can be taught. It does aim, the course, however, at removing the blocks to the awareness of love's presence, which is, which is our natural inheritance. So again, we're reviewing these lessons and lessons, you know, again, 181 to 200, and we're continuing to, you know, be awake to what our blocks are. You know, in the insanity of this world and in the belief that we're separate, we're actually operating 95% of the time, driven by our ego thought system and our subconscious. And again, in our belief that we're separate from God, you know, we're holding on to guilt and feeling we need to be punished and operating from there and operating from there, the scarcity principle. So in the text, it goes on. Uh, it says, I should say, in chapter 16, section 6, in lines 1 to 2, it says, 
Your task, again, is not to seek for love, but merely to seek and find all the barriers within yourself that you have built against love, against it. And it is not necessary to seek for what is true, but it is necessary to seek for what is false. It's necessary, that is the reading from the text, and it's necessary to recognize when you are coming from fear. Where, where are you caught up in you know, the false belief system, the unreality, the untruth? Again, that's our daily practice. You know, the amount of time that we recognize when we are not in reality or we are living in untruth, the amount of times it'll occur in a day may, may seem slight or maybe you're not even catching it at this point. That's why we do the lessons to stay conscious and aware and to continue to practice. Continue again to be devoted, dedicated to your practice. It takes discipline. Discipline is what we need to continue to practice. It's so easy to say, I can't do this. It's so easy to say, I, um, I don't have to do this or whatever other excuses that the ego will bring forward. I can't do it, so I'm not even gonna try. Discipline builds the muscle and it's really learning to discipline yourself. And actually discipline is a form of self love, which will bring you to that higher level of love that's within you. All right, so that is, Lesson 204, and again, as you go forward, remember, I am not a body. I am free, for I am still as God created me. And the name of God is my inheritance. All right. Thank you again, as always, for being here. And again, to help the, the algorithms in building this community, which is building, please like, comment share. I'd love to hear your comments and so would others. And if you haven't already, please subscribe. All right. I look forward to being with you for the next lesson in review six, which is lesson 205. All right. Have a love-filled day. And from my heart to yours, I extend much love to you. Bye for now.